Here we have quite a pretty flame, reminiscent of an aurora. The various colours come from the different ways electrons of different atoms absorb and release energy. Click here to watch a previous video in which I explain it in more depth. The base of the flame, the blue, comes from the burning of alcohols. The green tinges comes from the burning of boron. And the orange sections come from the burning of impurities in both the solution and the container itself. Either by using higher quality, more pure ingredients, or waiting for excesses to burn off, you end up with a more uniform green flame. This is because the green light of boron is more intense than the blue of the alcohols. If you want to make this at home, you require only two ingredients. Methanol. I use methylated spirits, but if you have access to a purer methanol, it does give a more intense green flame. But it is more dangerous. Speaking of which, make sure you stay safe while doing any experiment. Methanol is highly flammable and highly toxic. Make sure you take all necessary safety precautions when using it. The second ingredient is boric acid. Find a container that you don't use for either storing food or drink. Then add a small amount of the boric acid, methylated spirits or methanol, and mix well. Now you're ready to find somewhere non-flammable and heatproof to make some luscious green fire. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like and subscribe for more.